So the next feature that I want to show off here deals with duplicate records. Now, once again, I've got the example file open and I'm looking at the employee records worksheet. Now, in the employee records worksheet, we got a list of employee information. And I just now added a couple of duplicate records into this list, just for the demonstration here. Uh, now, I'm not going to identify them to you yet. I'm going to show you a really quick, effective way to find duplicate records. Now, I'm actually going to take this into two stages. One, we're first going to identify the duplicates. The second, we're then going to remove the duplicates. And we're going to use two different Excel features to perform these two separate commands. So take a look. Now, looking at my employee list, what might be the easiest way to identify if a record is duplicated, right? Can I do it by last name? Can I just say, well, if the last name duplicates in any of these records, it's considered a duplicate? Well, probably not, because you might have employees that have the same last name. So that's not really effective. But I do have an employee ID. And typically, IDs are unique. Each employee should only have their unique ID, and nobody else should have it. Okay? So I'm going to use the ID column. So first step, all I want to do is identify which ones are duplicated. So I'm going to highlight my IDs here. And I'm going to do this by clicking a set of A2. I'm going to use a keyboard shortcut to select the rest of them. I'm going to do Control, Shift, and my down arrow. And this will grab all of the values within that column. Essentially, Control, Shift, and your down arrow will jump all the way down and select it until it finds an empty cell, and then it stops. Ding! All right, so I've got them all highlighted there. Now that they're highlighted, I'm going to use a feature called Conditional Formatting. And I'm going to use a specific condition to say find duplicates. Watch this. They're highlighted. I'm now going to go to my Home tab. On my Home tab, I'm going to go back to Styles. I'm now going to go to Conditional Formatting. I'm going to go to Highlight Cell Rules. And down at the bottom, I'll go to Duplicate Values. Now, they're searching for duplicates. You can also say Find Unique. But I want to find duplicates. It's already giving me a format. Do a light red fill with dark red text. That sounds wonderful. I'm going to hit OK. And I can now see that 1067 was a duplicate. 1529, oops, there's the duplicates right there. There's the other 1067. So I've got two duplicate records, four total, but you know, they're, they're duplicating. So two times two equals four, right? I've got four records in here that were identified as duplicates, two of them actually. So using a little bit of conditional formatting just to identify the duplicates. Highlight the column or whatever set of data you're searching for duplicates within. Go to your Home tab, Conditional Formatting, and find those duplicates. And format it however you want. But remember, this is just one step. The second step, well, I've identified them. What are you going to do with them? I want to remove them. So in the next video, let's take a look at how you can remove those duplicates. But first, try this out. Identify the duplicates first before you remove them.